So I have a book that is called Road Work by Sally Sutton and illustrated by Brian Lovelock. And it is a story that basically shows us how to, how a road is built because we, you know, our roads don't disappear, right? In summertime, this time of year is when we see a lot of construction on the road because it's warm outside and the, um, the, the earth isn't cold and hard. It's easier to dig into. And yeah, so we are um, going to read our story by you know, Road Work by Sally Sutton. So let's see. So we're gonna, we need to plan the road, plan the road, mark it on a map. Hammer in the marking pegs, ping, bang, tap. So they are planning the road. These guys are probably maybe some of the engineers who planned it and designed the road, right? And then we have our construction workers. They're gonna help tell these people what they need to do to plan this road. <gasps> move the earth, move the earth, dig and cut and push, clear a pathway for the road, screech, boom, whoosh. So they are digging up that road path, right? <gasps> load the dirt, load the dirt, scoop and swing and drop, slam it down on into the truck, bump, whomp, whop. So they got, an, I believe this is called an excavator and they're digging up some of the dirt and putting it into this big old truck. Tip the stones, tip the stones, lift and slide in, dump, lay the groundwork for the road. Crash, roar, thump. So they are putting down some rocks uh, to make it nice and hard. Pack the ground, pack the ground, roll one way, then back. Make that roadbed good and hard. Cr lang, crunch, crack. So we have this rolly guy. Now all that rock, they're gonna pack it down onto the ground so it makes it nice and good and hard. We don't want a soft road, do we? Don't want to sink into that road while we drive over it. Seal the road, seal the road, make it hot and squishy. Spread that sticky tar and stones, splashy, splashy, splishy. So they got to get all this tar, right? So the, like if it starts to rain, it doesn't get into the rock and dirt to make it soft again, right? So they're gonna seal it with some tar. Roll the tar, roll the tar, make it firm and flat. Squash it down and press it out. Squelch, pluck, splat. So they're gonna roll it out and make it nice and flat and even. <gasps> stop the work, stop the work. Time to take, time to break for lunch. Sandwiches and drinks and fruit, gulp, slurp, crunch. So it's important. They got to, they're working hard, right? So they need to make sure they're, um, they're eating healthy, eating healthy fruits and water and sandwiches or eating healthy. So they have all the good energy they need to build this road. <gasps> mark the road, mark the road, give the paint a squirt, paint the lines in nice and straight. Whiz, splop, splurt. We need those lines, right? So the cars know which side to drive on. Raise the signs, raise the signs, drag and hoist and ram, force them down into their holes. The whack, whop, wham. Yeah, they're putting up signs so people know the right directions to go, and where to find things. Light the road, light the road. No one wants a crash. Test the lights and watch them shine. Flick, flack, flash. Yep, there, we gotta light that road up so people can see where they're going. And then plant the trees, plant the trees. Dig and stamp and lug. Water them to help them grow. Drip, drop, glug. So we have these great people. They are planting some nice pretty trees and bushes along the road so it is nice to pretty and to drive on, drive along. Tidy up, tidy up, lift and load and sweep. Drive away those big machines. So wish, clug, beep. So oh, I think we're almost finished and they're gonna, they need to move those, those big machines away so people can drive on the road. 
Shout hooray, the work is done. Ready now, let's zoom. Drive along your brand new road. Toot, honk, broom. So now we have, oh, all these people are driving along the new road that was engineered and constructed. And look at our construction workers, they're so happy. It's a good day when that work is finished, right? Absolutely, yeah. So that's a great example of how engineering something leads to constructing something is for our road work. Excellent. Okay, friends, we are going to move on and we are going to, we're gonna kind of switch paths a little bit instead of thinking about constructing and engineering something that's a little bit more physical, right? You know, we've talked about how you can build things that are more physical, like roads or buildings or toys. Um, but sometimes it's important to build other things that are kind of, that aren't as physical, like words. Because you you guys are at an age that you're learning your letters and learning to, you know, spell and read different words. And you got to know how to build them in your head so you know how to read them. So we are going to switch gears a little bit. We are going to look at an app called Endless Reader. And this, it's going to help us. We are going to build some words. And it is a lot of fun. So I'm going to switch over to a different device. Right now I'm on a computer. I'm going to switch over to an iPad so that um, uh, we can do that. So I'm going to You should be able to see. There we go. So yeah, so this is our Endless Reader app and it is really cool. Um, and all. Uh, learn all sorts of words. And I think Cake. you probably can hear some music, so I'm gonna talk a little bit louder so you can hear over me. Or uh, you can hear me over the music and words. All. So, yeah, so we are gonna start because Cake. I, um, I'm gonna, we're going to start with the word cake today. Their letter, their word cake. cake. <laughs> and so we need to build our word cake back up again. So what is the very first word that you see, or sorry, the very first letter that we need to put in? What's that very, very first letter? Is it our letter C? Yeah, let's drag and drop our letter C where it needs to go. C. Okay, so let's do our second letter. What's our second letter, friends? Is it our letter A? -A, -A, -A? Yeah! A. Our letter A is our second letter. And what's our third letter, friends? Is it our letter K? -K, -K? Is our letter K? K, perfect. And then what's our very last letter, friends? Is it our letter E? E. Yay! We K. have just built the word cake. <laughs> oh my goodness, our little monster friends kind of jumbled up our sentence. And it's important, we need to know how to make a sentence too, because that's how we speak, right? So let's see. We need, okay, it, our sentence says A, and then our word starts with our letter G, G, G. Where is our word that starts with our letter G? Can you find our word that starts with our letter G? Is it right down here? It is. Good. That is our word, good. So A, good, and then our second word that we need to put in is the word that we just made. Our, that starts with our letter C, -c, -c, C. So let's our word cake. Cake. Excellent. And then, so a good cake is, and then our third word that is missing from our sentence starts with our letter T T T T. What? And maybe you already know this word. It's the word the. The. Yeah, we have just completed our sentence from the missing words. Look at this little guy. A good cake is the yummiest part of a birthday party. A good cake is the yummiest part of a birthday party. Absolutely. Do you love a good piece of cake at a birthday party? I know I do. Nice. So we are going to do one more word, friend. I'm going to see what time it is. 
If we're gonna do one more word, let's go to our next word. Dog. I like this word. <laughs> it is our word dog. So we are gonna build our word dog. So what's that very first letter that we wanna put in? Is it our letter D? -d, -d, -d? Yeah. D. So our first letter is our letter D, -d, 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 -d. What's our second letter, friends? Is it our letter uh, 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 O? O. Excellent. And then what's our last letter? What letter is that? Is our letter G, 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 G? G. We made the word dog. And look, our little dog looks like a little doggy. Oh my goodness, they jumbled up our sentence again. So let's put our words where they need to go. It says, Yoshi thinks it is funny. Oh, that's our first word that we need to find. Where's our word that says funny that starts with our letter F, F, F? F, 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 F. Is it right down here? Funny. Funny. Okay. Yoshi thinks it is funny to dress. What's this next word? It's our word up. And it starts with our letter yeah 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 you can you find our word that starts with our letter u it's right here up excellent and then she likes to dress up her and then this is the word we just built right our word da -da dog let's put our word dog where it dog. needs to go <laughs> yay we did it good job friends <gasps> Oh my goodness, what is she doing? Have you ever put high heels on your dog? She does Yoshi it thinks funny. it is funny to dress up her dog. Oh my goodness, she thinks it's so funny. Well friends, well thank you. We are going to finish up, so I'm going to... We are going to finish up our Littles Lab today, so thank you for joining me today. I really hope you enjoyed our story and our app that's called Endless Reader. Um, and uh, if you're joining, we'll be doing uh, our last Littles Lab with the theme, Let's Construct Our Engineer, next Tuesday, or our very last day of June, on June, Tuesday, June 20, or sorry, June 30th. Um, but then we are not having Little's Lab this Saturday on June 27th or then the first Saturday of July, which is July 4th, because we will be closed. But hopefully we will see you again next week. So thanks for joining us today and we'll see you again soon. Bye.